morning everyone. Today for a change I'm going to be painting on a rectangular surface rather than a square. I've already coated it with white and I'm just going to remove the air bubbles. And I think we have some other things that don't really want to be on the canvas. I'm going to be using three of my most favourite colours. Phthalo blue. Sorry, it's Prussian blue, but I think actually it's similar to phthalo blue that you buy from other manufacturers. Uh, copper and Pebio emerald green. So start with the Prussian blue. And I'm going to <laughs> do it in a line and then the emerald green and finish off with the copper. So we'll surround this with wet white. Blow the white over on top of the paint and then probably this way blow the paint out. Just to get rid of any extra air bubbles that have popped up. Yeah, there's a few. Okay. I have uh, narrowed down the nozzle of my hairdryer because uh, I felt it was blowing the paint too wide somehow. And this, I think, seems to be more successful. So we just keep experimenting. Right. And I think I'm going to stop there. taking out air bubbles and also encouraging any cells that might want to form. copper somehow seemed to get buried underneath the other paints. So I'm just encouraging it to come back out again. Different, interesting, a bit disappointed that the copper didn't spread further, it's sort of clumped in the middle, possibly it clumped because it was ever so slightly, I don't know if you can see this on the video, but just ever so slightly too thick, it's not completely pouring smoothly off the end of the stick. There you go. Gives it a focal centre and it should be lovely and shiny metallic when it dries. So I think we'll, we'll let this dry and see how it pans out. I'll bring you around for a close-up. So this is the close-up. Uh, I think the painting works better horizontally 
than vertically. It gives the effect of like a waterfall or water splashing down. It's uh, some nice cells forming here. I think this copper, when it dries, will be lovely and shiny rather than just the dark brown that it is at the moment. Um, this paint with the cells in the green and blue colours works really well. Just so reminiscent of water and water splashing around. So thank you for watching. If you've enjoyed watching, please subscribe to my video channel and keep on the lookout for more videos. Bye. And just a quick photograph of the finished painting before you go. It dried perfectly. <laughs>